Hi, my name is Uthman Samai. I'm 21 years old, and here is an inside look into our South African men's ice hockey team. I hope you enjoy it. I am Luke Carlson. I'm 21 years old. I was born in Cape Town, South Africa. My name is Andre Mare. I'm 33 years old, and I'm born in Cape Town, South Africa. My name is Christopher Reeves. Uh, I'm 25 years old. I was born in Johannesburg, South Africa, but grew up in Cape Town. I'm uh, Mark Gio. I'm 33 years old, and I'm from Cape Town, South Africa. I'm Wesley Kratz. I'm 19 years old, and I'm born in South Africa, Cape Town. Hi, my name is Ashley Bock, uh, 27 years old, born in Benoni, South Africa. I've been playing for South Africa for six years now. I've been playing since 1995, so we're going on 19 years now, or well, actually 20 years, officially. For South Africa, I've been playing since uh, I was 22, so that would be about four championships. I've been playing for South Africa since 1999, three years for the men's team. For South Africa, uh, the senior national team, I'm in my 10th year at the moment. It feels like a real honor to represent uh, my country in ice hockey. It's an honor, it's a privilege, and every single time I do it, I enjoy it a little bit more. It's a true, true privilege, I must say, especially when when we're playing at home, we've got a whole stand full of home fans. It's, it's a really great feeling. Uh, it's a great honour. Uh, it's the, one of the best feelings to be able to put on your country's jersey and play in front of your home crowd uh, and win gold. Oh, it's always an honour when you get to play for your country. You, know, you get to pull on that shirt for the first game every year and it's always you know, goosebumps down the back, hands are tingling. It's always a brilliant moment in your life. Um, I think the highlight moment would be in 2013 when uh, our SA team won the gold medal in the third division, I think, um, at home, which is a big uh, step for our team and a big team building experience. The one that stands out is I got a lucky opportunity to take a penalty shot in my first tournament in 1999. I faked forehand, I went backhand. <laughs> And it was pretty special. Family was in the crowd too, so yeah, it was a good moment for me. The first time I put on an SA jersey and uh, represented my country. To be honest, last night's win over New Zealand, uh, the 3-1 win against New Zealand, brilliant effort beating them. It's national rivalry, never beaten them before, and to come out and play like that in that game is awesome feeling. I think uh, the SA team keeps me motivated. You know, every year we have a big tournament that brings us all together and it just drives us to make us play better and keep working on, on our individual skills. I think it's about continually wanting to improve, continually wanting to be better every single time. And knowing that you've got younger guys wanting your jersey is a continual motivation to be better than them in the way that's more in competitive spirit than it is about you know, my own personal game. Um, and you know what, when you play the sport, if the day you decide you want to stop being good is the day you should hang up your skirts. It's really great being a part of the South African team. Um, and I think I mainly just want to do it for the other players. Um, I, I want to continue to be in the team and, yeah, be a part of the whole, the whole experience. Um, even though it happens once a year, it's, it's worth it. Uh, when age catches up, the best thing to do for me is to, uh, to stay fit, um, look at guys that I play with uh, and, and uh, guys I have to play against, one of those guys with Minsumai, uh, and try to keep up and try to play better and uh, stronger and faster than he does, which is a tough task. I uh, personally, I try to better myself at every practice, every game. If I do something bad, I try to better that. And I just started better myself at every time I get an eye. It used to just be to have some fun and get to travel and play some good games. Now I actually have some good competition for goalkeeping, so that's pretty much how I keep myself motivated at the moment. 
I guess uh, train hard and just stick to your your own personal strengths. Like for me, um, stick handling with the puck and making plays happen and looking out for good passes. The best advice I've given was to remain calm and play the game as though you are the best. Believe in yourself all the time and don't don't for a minute think you you've made a mistake and that it's going to count against you. Just keep going and believe and believe and believe, even if you lie to yourself. All it takes is all you've got, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Never give up. That's pretty much one of the, the best pieces of advice I've been given. Just play hard, enjoy yourself, and just play hockey. <laughs> to be honest, it was actually yesterday afternoon, just go into the game, be yourself, have some fun. Don't be afraid to show people that you know, you are having fun while you're playing.